It's me, Pataski Pete, back here with you at KAG Studios. Today we will learn about rounding numbers to the nearest ten. Rounding numbers means you change the value of a number to one that is easier to work with. We'll learn two ways for rounding, one using a place value chart, and the other using a number line. Hey, let's get started. We'll start learning about rounding by using a place value chart. Today's lesson is rounding to the nearest 10. So in this case, we have three tens and two ones. The first step is to circle the digit that is in the tens place because we are rounding to the nearest 10. Next, we look at the digit to the right. In this case, it is a 2. And if the digit is less than 5, you do not change the circled digit. Instead, you replace all of the digits after the circled digit with zeros. So our 32 becomes 30. Let's try that again. Let's take the number 65 and round it to the nearest 10. First, we circle the digit to be rounded. In this case, it is a 6. And then, we look at the digit to the right. If that digit is 5 or greater, we add a 1 to the circled digit. Replace all the digits after the circle digit with zeros. 6 plus 1 becomes 7, and the 5 becomes a 0. Our rounded number is 70. And now for the part of the lesson that we call review. Circle the digit to be rounded. Look at the digit to its right. If that digit is less than 5, do not change the circle digit. If the digit is 5 or greater, you add a 1 to the circled digit. Replace all the numbers following the circled digit with zeros. Hey guys! Are you still listening? I'm going to show you another way to use rounding, this time on a number line. Let's say we want to round the number 32 to the nearest 10. We look at the closest 10 less than 32 and we see that it is 30 on the left. The closest 10 greater than 32 is 40 and it is on the right. We put the number 32 in its proper spot on the number line and we can see that 32 is closer to 30. So 32 rounds down the number line to the number 30. Hey now, check this out. Let's round 65 to the nearest 10. Looking at our number line, we see the closest 10 below 65 is 60. And the closest 10 greater than 65 is 70. Placing 65 in the proper spot on the number line and following our rules of looking to the right if it's 5 or greater, we round up we can see that 65 rounds up to 70. Okay, now sometimes people will give you a problem that says round to the nearest 10 when there's a 100 place. Well, don't let that confuse you. Rounding to the nearest 10, you still circle the digit in the tens place. You look at the digit to its right, and if that digit is 5 or greater, you add 1 to the digit in the tens place. Just ignore the digit in the hundreds place. So, we add a 1 to the digit in the tens place, and that becomes a 7, and all the digits following that are zeros. 
So our rounded number is 270. Okie dokie, little rascals. That completes our lesson for today. But the next lesson will be about rounding hundreds. And you know what I think? Kids achieving greatness like you? I'll bet you can figure that one out. Give it a try.